So I'm gonna give Andrea the Selena Gomez look today. So I'm gonna put a little primer that has a little bit of color all over the face with my foundation brush. You have a little bit of a Selena Gomez look. <laughs> I'm gonna throw a little foundation. And I like to mix to get the right color. So I'm basically going in down motions, my foundation brush. You can go nice and slow if you'd like, or nice and fast. Doesn't matter. But I like to go down on the neck a little bit so it evens out. And if I use too much, my little magic trick, my sponge, and I wet it a little bit, squeeze the excess water, and blend it in softly. Now, Selena's very young, and what I like about young skin, it's always dewy and glowy and pretty, doesn't look dry or dull. I always recommend using lots of moisturizer, sometimes a illuminating tinted moisturizer is fun. What I'm gonna do is, after I put the foundation on, I'm not gonna throw any powder on her because I want a nice, young, dewy, natural look. So this is my illuminating tinted moisturizer. It doesn't really have much of a color from Stila. But you see how dewy it is? Look at that. It looks white on my hand, but trust me, it doesn't have any color. Smile. And I'm putting it on her cheeks because I want her cheeks to be glowy. So I'm going right on the apples. You could put a lot on, it's okay. I go crazy with this stuff. Especially when I'm giving a young, dewy look. Sometimes I actually even throw Vaseline on the face, believe it or not, it gives a nice shine to it. And I throw it on the forehead. Nose, chin. Mainly on the cheeks and chin. And then if you want, sometimes I put it down here. Whatever you have left over, don't waste it. Put it on the neck, put it on the collarbone. Have fun with it, it's illuminating. And it also gives a very nice young look. And this is the face we're starting with for Selena Gomez.